The fact that art can be seen as technically useless makes it very important. If you reduce everything to pragmatic uses, purposes and statistics, you actually endorse a very harsh life perspective. I've been making artworks for some years now. A lot of times I'm very interested in tactility and visuality and I like to focus on things that engage our senses. I think my journey has really been an NAC story. If not for various kinds of support from the NAC, I might probably not even have continued to be in the arts. I think one of the main challenges has been how precarious it can be to be in a creative career. A lot of times there are many years that you have to spend pursuing an idea that you have and it can be quite a lonely thing and oftentimes paying or finding your own support to create work that you want to do. A few years ago, I co-founded an independent shared space with three other Singaporean artists. It's part of how I hope or believe that creative work and art can build these spaces of empathy where we can find ways to communicate and understand each other. My hope for the Singapore art scene is that it can develop into a vibrant and diverse ecosystem with many different levels and kinds of interaction and support. I would really like to thank all the special people in my life who've supported me, put up with me, encouraged me and believe in my work. Thank you for mentoring me, loving me and accepting me.